Para mí, la tierra es la vida. Pero ir a la tierra, ir al campo y trabajar con algo que te da de comer, algo que tú ves nacer y crece y al rato ves su fruto y lo tomas y lo saboreas en tu, en tu boca, en tu paladar, eso es lo máximo que puede un ser humano sentir en la vida. Eso soy yo, es lo que me gusta. Está reconocido que el gusano cogollero es la plaga más perjudicial para el maíz. Si no controlamos el gusano, el gusano se le acaba en cuestión de semanas. The estimates of losses to pests around the world uh, vary anywhere from 5% to, to 20%. And that is an enormous loss. Farmers operate typically on very narrow profitability margins. So a loss of 5%, let alone 20%, can really be very, very serious. The dream has been to find technologies and interventions that can specifically target a pest and leave everything else well enough alone. We study the most exciting and effective design process on the planet, and that's evolution. There'd been a 30-year history of using very expensive, chemically synthesized pheromones for crop protection in expensive crops. But you couldn't even conceive of spraying pheromones in a cornfield. What I love about pheromones is it's so simple. The idea is so simple and it's so elegant. So the moths that have the caterpillars, those are their babies, and the caterpillars that eat all the farmer's crops, those moths, they find each other by using this molecular plume. She emits this infinitesimal quantity of perfume that the male smells. And it just so happens that we can leverage this language, the language of pheromones, with the new technologies that we have available to us we can recreate the same pathways that the insects themselves use. You install the dispenser in the beginning of the season just as the crop is germinating, and then the pheromone works over time, confusing the males so that the males don't find the females. 90% don't reproduce, and therefore less damage in the next generation. <laughs> The grower is able to use less chemical inputs, having less exposure in the field to chemicals, and also better preserving the biodiversity in the field. Pues sí, le digo, pero es que esta no se trata de matarla. El animalito va a seguir vivo, y eso es bueno porque también tiene derecho a vivir. There are many other insects that also live in that field, and they often provide a service back to the grower. So really understanding all of those in a holistic manner is, is really key to get a complete picture. The important difference between Provivi's technology is that biology comes in together with state-of-the-art chemical synthesis methods and synthetic biology. And that combination allows us to make a whole panoply of different pheromones targeting very specific pests at lower cost. Provivi understands that this technology could really improve the lives of hundreds of millions of subsistence farmers in developing nations. I'm extremely optimistic about the ability of the world to feed itself in the future in a way that is much more environmentally sustainable than we've done so in the past. Como que tengo una estrella de que las cosas me llegan solitas. Y si este producto es nuevo, pues digo, todo cambia. Entonces, ¿por qué eh, mantenernos en el pasado? Me siento más uh, tranquilo usando. Entonces, pues no, no creo que vuelva yo para atrás.